Well, you know, if we had cardinal sins anymore, it doesn't seem the way the society is going and that's happening, but this would be one of them right here. You're leaving a short putt short. We've already said that that's one of the worst things you can do in putting, is to leave a little short putt like that short of the cup. You got to thinking, well, let's see, how many putts in my life did I hit that I hit too easy that went in? You never made one. But you've hit a lot of putts that were, well, they were almost too hard. I mean, they went past the front of the cup, they hit clear in the back of the cup, but they still went in. So you can hit them a little bit hard, you can't hit them too easy. So the way you get the feeling of a little bit more acceleration through, so it's a little firmer, you can put two tees in the ground, put a golf pencil right in between, and say, now I'm going to hit it hard enough to jump the pencil. Now this wouldn't do it. See, if I just went up there like that and tapped it, that stops it right there and it won't go in. So I want to hit it hard enough so it will jump the pencil. When we hit it hard enough to jump the pencil, then it looks something like this. It's kind of fun, isn't it? Just jumps right up in the air and goes over. Well, oh, that's so much fun, let's do it again. I'm going to hit it hard enough to jump right over that pencil. So we go it back, take it through, run it up there and say, bump it over the pencil. That'll bunch it over there. There it did it.